Okay, never mind, never mind. I am late because I like to eat salty nuts and roll them around in my mouth. What's up, buddies? Welcome back to another day in the life of the First Owner RTG, where we are debating. Debating a few things, actually. So, if you're excited for the episode, although I don't know if you really will really be excited for today, because EA have bottled it again. Apparently, La Liga red player picks are completely broken and glitched. To the point where anybody that got gold 2 and up, so gold 2, gold 1, elite 3, elite 2, elite 1, top 100, were not getting La Liga players in their picks. So if you're like a top 100 player, an elite 3 player, and you opened your 5 red player pick pack, you got 5 um, Turkish League players. Now, it, you could still get La Liga players in there, but basically what EA did is they essentially coded all packs like silver 1 and uh, gold 3 packs, where... You just get whatever you get and sometimes you're lucky and you get a La Liga player. So what they've done apparently, if you weren't lucky enough to sit there and open your packs and essentially get screwed over, um, which essentially means you're going to get double the red picks. So like me, I was sleeping or if you were working or whatever, you didn't get to participate in that. So you and I get to claim our uh, gold two, whatever rewards, and then we just get denied the red player pick. So EA have gotten rid of the red player pick packs entirely right now and it's been about seven or eight hours and they have not really let us know anything at all um of what they're doing or how they're improving it so red player pick day is completely dead in terms of red player pick packs which is super annoying but down the road or you know hopefully in a few hours or maybe for tomorrow's epi we'll be able to open our red player pick pack so that's the first update if you were lucky enough to open those packs and you even got La Liga players, just know that later on, as long as EA aren't idiots, uh, you will get another set of two red player picks. At the same time, I will get my two red player picks, which again, I'm hoping it's not going to be like the last time they screwed up red picks. It took them like four or five days to fix it. So into next week, which is just all around annoying. On every level, it's very annoying. I'm sure a lot of you guys that put still put time into this game, one of the most enjoyable things is to get your Thursday rewards and then try and structure and build a team around um, those lucky red picks. So anyways, we've got a lot to get through today. Usually Thursday is my onslaught of packs and spamming and going crazy uh, with upgrade packs. As I've said a few times, I'm not that interested or excited with La Liga. I already have the 97 Messi. I love that Messi. I don't really care to try and chase a 99 Messi. And really, other than Frankie de Jong and that Messi, those are the only two players that not only could get into my dream team, but would be the players I'd be excited about. So for the big boy pack spam, we should be starting later, well, later this week, tomorrow. If we get the Bundesliga... We are going to put this club into administration to hopefully chase for a Alfonso Davies, the Canadian dream, um, which obviously I'm very excited about. Now, usually in the loading screen, we get a sneak peek. So is it Serie A? Is it Bundesliga? Is it Ligue 1? There it is. There it is, boys. Oh my God. Is that Alfonso Davies on the left? Hey, ho, 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 ho. Well, now we know that we're getting the Bundesliga tomorrow. Please tell me. That's an Alfonso Davies. I really hope EA don't screw it up and make Alfonso Davies a left mid. Like, if you've watched Bayern, Bayern fans, you tell me, right? But at least in the Champions League, in the few games I've watched Alfonso Davies ball out, he's always on that left wing side, left wing back side. So I think at worst, they give us a left wing back Alfonso Davies, our left back Alfonso Davies, but I'm very, very, very excited for that, man. I actually do think this could be that an Alfonso card on, on, on the left side, man. Which is very exciting. Cam, uh, the 93 roll. I'm not entirely sure. We'll post a few things to Instagram in terms of graphics and artwork uh, that Armalika is going to put together for the Bundesliga. Um, have a look at that Alfonso Davies and the potential of his card. But there we go. So, as of tomorrow, Project Fonzi Davies' Team of the Season card pack pulled will begin. We failed Calvin Phillips's challenge. We're going to do our very best with a uh alfonso davies and here's the debate do we oh i can't believe i'm doing this do we cash out everything and go right back to just a pure i mean either way this series is all first owner everything we do on this account is first owner but i'm once again debating whether or not we go full cash out 
and then go full send on trying to pack a team of the season Davies? Or, or do we keep things as they are and then just use the assets that we have without getting rid of our whatever dude team with the prime Cruyff, with the team of the season, uh, Calvin Phillips and all of that stuff. So I'm kind of in two minds as to what exactly I want to do. I'm still thinking like, because I'm having so much fun with this grind right now and what we're doing and being able to use my, my favorite players for weekend league games, I think I'm going to keep it to the whatever dude weekend league team and then everything. And this account is all first owner from, from there onwards. But some part of me wants to go like full send on Thursday where we go unassigned on a million or two millions worth of players, of rare players, to then open 200 or 325k Bundesliga packs. Well, let's go see. So last week we got the Premier League 25k packs and you guys, if you saw on stream or you saw the review for Friday's episode of my pack luck in three hours of grinding 40 or starting with 30 Premier League upgrade packs. I spent three or four hours grinding and rinsing and not discarding anything. And you guys saw all the amazing pack luck. So, do EA adjust and not give us 25k packs for the Bundesliga? I would be disgusted if they did that. But I also kind of expect it because of how good they were for the Premier League. Did we get them or did we not? I'm going to do another grind of these for tomorrow too. And maybe these for Alfonso Davies, right? If, if he gets in, he does start as a base silver, left mid. Um, so that'll be interesting. La Liga challenge. La Liga upgrade. No! So we did get it! We did get it, dudes! Fantastic! That's great! La Liga premium player pack. So there it is. Okay, for those of you guys. So good news. Thursday, next week will be the Bundesliga Alfonso Davies spam. I think we are going to go unassigned. And then for the rest of Thursday or whatever, <clears throat> we'll rinse them through uh, the upgrade packs where and how we can do it. I guess we'd spend, what, the first three or four hours on the web app putting them into uh, the 25k packs? And then and then from the web app, kind of like Nick, Nick did that, right? Didn't he last Thursday or on Monday... I think my day off on Monday, I was watching a bit of his stream and he spent the first three or four hours crafting like 300 La Liga 82 plus packs, didn't he? Okay, so anyways, I'll do a bit of these and maybe later tonight we will do a few of these just to test it out. Um, let's just go confirm that it is just 11 rares. That's the hope that we have. Beautiful. I, You know what, man? EA and the red picks and EA and the dead servers is disappointing. But I do really like that they're bringing these out. It sucks that it's only for 24 hours, but I, I I like it, man. I do like it a lot. Okay, fantastic. So in terms of anything else, we got the throwback marquee matchups, which I don't know. Maybe we'll piece together slowly but surely. We can double check this real quick to see if there's anything good there for you guys in terms of... Nope. So they've done what they can to make sure player prices don't go up here. Silvers and bronzes don't really go up. 77 rated for Ajax and Alkmaar. Atletico Madrid, two of them though. Um, and then Everton and Chelsea as well. How are the packs themselves though? These are going to be saved for Alfonso Davies tomorrow. Okay, not bad. We'll do, we'll do this. We'll definitely, definitely, definitely do this. And tradable team of the week. Tradable team of the week upgrade. All right. Um, okay. Don't really care about that. Uh, can unfavorite that. Do that one. La Liga upgrade the 82 plus packs. Now I'm not going to do that anymore. That one's not really worth putting our, our players into. I think it's just all 25k packs will be better. Uh, definitely not these anymore, of course. Oh, and Madison! Oh my god! What the hell? Madison? Dude! I love Madison this year, man. See, what sucks for me, having such a crazy club in terms of first owner, is as awesome as this Madison, I know this Madison's gonna be amazing. Honestly, I know how good this card is gonna be. And because of his passing stats, I would personally give him a sniper if you're gonna use him as a central cam. You're talking not... Oh, you know what? A sniper might almost be a waste. 
actually. He could almost just roll a, ma a maestro. You could roll a maestro if you wanted to. Um, but anyways, maestro or sniper, or whatever it is. If you go sniper, you're talking 92 balance, 99 agility. Uh, I think his reactions go to 82, ball control to 99, dribbling to 97, composure to 92, finishing to 99 or 96, attack positioning to 98. That's a crazy card, man. That is a crazy, crazy card. You could give him an engine if you wanted to, if you're happy with his shooting, of course. Actually, an engine might be even better because his finishing and shot power is crazy. Nah, you know what? Engine, memes aside, is the move. And with an engine, do reactions go up? I think they go up by five the 77 reactions is a bit dumb but other than that four star four star high medium five nine he's this is all about the meta this card is fantastic absolutely absolutely fantastic yeah you could go marksman to maestro um engine dead eye you could go with i'd probably work on some of that dribbling though and composure but very nice very very nice card so Four days remaining, unfortunately. So if he's someone that you like, you're going to have to chip away at. So it's an 83 rated squad. That's chill. 84 rated squad and 85 rated squad. I was expecting him. Dude, consider how much. Yeah, Jota. Do you remember how much Jota was and how much they basically pissed on the community with the requirements for that card? Look at how affordable this guy is. 140k. Oh, I'm going to get this guy. I, I will 100% get this guy on our account. I love Madison this year. His headliners card was super sick. Um, so I'm definitely going to chip away. Any duplicates? We've got four days. Dudes, we're going to be spamming packs like crazy. So any duplicates that are untradeable or, or 84s and 85s, I will chip away and get this guy um, through the next two or three days. 100%. No, no doubts about it. And unfortunately, that might be the end for Mesut Ozil in our Prem team. This might be our central camp. This guy, I know I'm going to be in love with as my central cam. So I can't, I can't wait to use him. All right, cool. Did they... So two more questions for you guys. Did they bring back uh, the Pro League? Has that come back? Mm, okay, well, that wouldn't tell me anyways. Let's go check over here. Look at all of these waiting for the team of the seasons, man. I got to start chipping away at the Saudi League and Pro League again, considering how many bronze packs... Got to do the Prem, the Championship as well. La Liga got to start chipping away at. I think what we're going to start doing for all the, uh, you know, Liga MX. So no, it didn't come back. So for Liga MX, uh, where are we at here? Conman Ball, Sudamerica, of course. La Liga, all the teams that have the team of the seasons and that we've completed. I think what we're going to do is every day to finish off the day, we're going to go through and complete any team that I have like, you know seven or eight players or more i think that's gonna so like once you know once a day to end off the day i'm gonna go through each team and just see okay do i have you know six or seven of this team boom i'll finish this one off six or seven of the team in here and then the ones that i don't we'll just keep chipping away um and then eventually once we have two or three teams remaining we'll just complete the whole set and then we'll get another nice high rated player not to mention all those packs that'll replenish every other part of the club so that is going to be the system and the process for that so i'm glad we kind of flushed that out and figured it all out now unfortunately as mentioned we do not get uh the red player picks which is of course what i was absolutely looking forward to the most but we'll complete our um uh rank three rewards again i'm not really playing through i don't know i don't know what those rank three rewards even were but anyways it's all good we will be opening packs but because, as you guys know, I want to grind and focus on... Did I do one of the Falcals by accident? Yeah, Rivals. I guess we did that one by accident. I wonder how many other ones I did by accident yesterday. Let's see. One out of four there. Score and assist in Rivals with fours. Four, okay, that's not too hard to do, I guess. Icon Swap. So yesterday we finished off the League and Grind. Today, if you guys paid attention to the, uh, to the team... We are going to do the world beaters. So this one's annoying, but you need to win five rivals matches with two Prem, two Liga, and two Serie A, two Bundesliga, two La Liga players. Now you could make it easy and just go like a full French team. But first of all, it's a first owner account. So it kind of got to use what we got. And second of all, even on 92 chem, I think this team's kind of fun and cool and should make playing. Uh, 
about to say should make playing the rivals games fun not fun uh but bearable so that's what we're gonna plan on doing uh for the rest of the day on stream second third fourth fifth whatever the points are from here what i want to do as well is i think i'm gonna go all in on uh getting walmart hullet i think we're gonna finally get walmart hullet dudes i need because bear with me if we put the club into administration next week for alfonso davies that means 99 de Bruyne is gonna go which means we then can use those coins towards going into administration um which means that walmart hullet will actually be needed because i don't really have a good box to box dm that can link up the dream team the way i want it linked up so i think we're gonna do it sandorf is not better like to all of you guys that are saying wait but your gerard is is better or your sandorf is better i don't find them better so i look at this hullet and think he'll actually be very usable if i put a guardian on him with a guardian he still has pretty damn good acceleration and sprint speed fantastic shooting stats for a box-to-box -box mid fantastic passing stats physical stats are a little bit trash i'm not gonna lie um but with a guardian we're talking 96 defensive awareness 94 setting tackle 94 interceptions 84 agility uh 87 reactions 97 ball control 85 dribbling and 99 composure so um i'm gonna go for it every single person is saying i'm gonna regret getting this card uh and i'm gonna hate getting this card but realistically dudes who the hell else for 15 tokens is gonna even have a chance to get into my teams maldini is never getting into any of my teams he's not Ricardo Kaká is not getting into any of my teams, dudes. In the whatever dude team, we've got a prime icon moment, Cruyff, a Neymar, 94, a 97 Messi, and a Cristiano Ronaldo. Kaká is not getting into the teams. He's not. Maldini is not getting into the teams. Lampard, not getting into the teams. I'm sorry. I I'd rather have a five-star weak-footed uh, Hullet here instead. Um over mars absolutely not the only other debate i'm having right now is this carlos puyol for maybe a past and present barca team maybe so i've thought about this for a while i think most people are going to say this is a waste i want to figure it out for myself it's a walmart hullet i'm well aware that this is just a trash representation of rude hullet but i gotta do it i gotta i gotta I gotta scratch my own itch, if that makes sense, dudes. Everybody's telling me I'm gonna be an idiot for doing this, but we gotta finally get this Walmart Hullet. I've been humming and hawing about it forever, and maybe today, instead of even doing the rest of the icon swaps, maybe I use the main team to practice for Weekend League tomorrow. We'll play like four or five games with this Walmart Hullet and just see how good or awful he is. So we can use the whatever dude Weekend League team uh, to practice, right? Not to do swaps or objectives or, or anything like that, but... And then we've got one, uh, where is it? Two, three, four, five, six. So we'll also be able to get the 91, what's his face? The Finnish dude. You're gonna regret it after one game? See, I'm not gonna regret it either way because I just don't care. Wait, am I missing one? Hold on a second. Don't you need six? That's 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I'm, I'm missing one. Did the irony is, could I even, I couldn't even get Kaka, could I? Did I, did I miss doing one somewhere? You're one away from Kaka. I'm doing it. I don't want Kaka. Dude, Kaka's card is a disgrace. Very similar to this one. The only Kaka that is even worthy of Kaka's name is the Moments Kaka, and I can't get him. So I'm doing it. We're getting Walmart Hullet, and I hope he's good. I want him to be so good. I want him to be so good so I can just shove him in everybody's face. 
Look at Walmart Brood. He's the VTech version of the 94 in terms of player type, body type. That's an L. Dude, I love how mad people are right now. Send roots. All right. I hope he's good, man. Please, God. Please be good. I want my chat to be so mad because I like this card. This is going to be a deciding factor as to whether or not Project Hullet continues. If this card is even remotely usable. Um, oh, and by the way, yes, this is the first owner account. I've been seeing so many of you guys saying, hey, dude, we get it, whatever. But can you show us the whatever dude team every once in a while? So for those of you guys that care, this has nothing to do with this series, obviously, or specifically this account. This is just like the stream setup. But just for those of you guys that have been asking and are interested or whatever, this is what the team currently looks like. Um, but we are going to make some adjustments, okay? So first adjustment is going to be that. Um, I actually think I'm going to keep Perea on the field. I don't think Robertson is good enough at all, man. Okay, so second adjustment is going to be um, this. And then, oh, wow, what a delivery. Thank you, baby. I can't believe that I'm taking out the best box-to-box -box midfielder in the game for Walmart Hullet. That's the, that's the real Hullet. That's the real Hullet. But whatever, that's fine. We'll, we'll work towards that. Robo's the best left back in the game? Not at all. Not, not at all for me, at least. That's hilarious, dude. Um, okay, so... Rude. I gotta show you guys, though, man. Those of you guys that say this card won't be good at all... We gotta, we gotta try and disprove this, disprove this myth, man. Check it, dude. Medium, medium, 6'3", 5-star weak foot. With those stats? I, bro, I think that's a sick card! No strength? 82 strength is fine. All I really need is going to be our box-to-box -box warrior. You know, 95 slide tackle, so we'll be able to snap people in half. 78 stamina basically means that De Bruyne or Vidal is going to come on in the 60th minute. That's the the only issue here with this Walmart Hullet is the fact that he will be dead in 40 minutes with how I play the game. Those stats are so average. I mean, the irony is, for how I want to build this team, I don't have anything better, guys. So for those of you guys that are mad, Sadorf is awful. Gerard is awful at this point in the game. This is the only option I have, unless I go back to those guys. So, until we can get ourselves a Rude Hullet, this is going to be the dream team, of course, with a, hopefully, 90 or 89, or I, I would assume it would be at least 90 or 91 rated uh, Fonzie Davies over here. And then this team will be relatively done. We're going to work towards a 99 Ronaldo, and we're going to work towards the real Rude Hullet. A 90 rated one, maybe from mid-icon packs, or a 93 rated fresh or a 94 rated fresh. So realistically, my dream team for the whatever dude squad is done other than 99 Ronaldo, 93 Hullet or 90 Hullet and a team of the season Davies, which is fantastic. I'm very, very happy about that. I mean, this De Bruyne is going to be sold. Probably, maybe, may, probably, maybe we'll sell him off tomorrow, uh, tomorrow evening and then we'll get Vidal in the team as a super sub. That's what, uh, I think that's what we're going to do. The amount of people that are going to be triggered that I'm using a a Walmart Hullet over a 99 De Bruyne, I actually can't wait to see the reaction on Twitter and potentially even in the comments section. Pure confirmation bias? Confirmation bias about what? Tell me. One thing we said is I would love to run this team. There's no confirmation bias here. Let's have a discussion. If I could, I would run this team. I would. 100%. But EA and their moronic chemistry setup does not let me run this. I would love to. And I would love to put Jonathan David, if he gets a team of the season card, in Ronaldo's spot. Jonathan David up front. Uh, Johan as my cam. Messi as my wide left. Uh, sorry, uh, Neymar as my wide left. Messi as my wide right. Uh, you know, Calvin as my holding DM. De Bruyne as my... Um, as my as my box to box alfonso is left and well realistically allison wouldn't even be in the team let's just say for argument's sake 
um like let me have this as the setup J just for argument's sake it's so dumb that i have to take such a massive hit to use the players that i want to use so within ea's requirements i unfortunately have to roll with this dudes until i can get myself the good version of rude hullet so for those of you guys that are so angry tell me what else i could do when you know that clarence sadorf plays terribly when you know that stevie g is just not that great anymore now is this rude hullet better than stevie g the one that i've had in my club for four or five months no he's not i'm i'm, I'm honestly i'm not even not even really going to argue that he's he's absolutely absolutely not however it gives me a precursor to when we do have a good version of uh of rude hullet in the team so that's all man like sorry that you guys are mad about it but that's my thought process with it and that's what uh that's what i'm going to do and it kind of makes me excited because i think we'll be up to like almost five million coins which realistically means this walmart hullet probably won't be in the team for more than one or two weekends we should be able to build up towards a um fresh 93 in fact again this has nothing to do with this first owner rtg but just because we're here right now let's have a look what are we talking what are we talking mid sadover is not better than that hullet i disagree fully god damn has he gone up in price he was six mil or five something like high fives wow he has gone up in price all right we're still a couple mil away dudes we're still a couple mil away now without further ado i think we can also get ourselves into um some of these packs now i also did get trolled for those of you guys that uh were here late night we're popping a few of the uh devil's laboratory packs Just, just, uh, just, 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 just one more time. Wait, Suarez? No! Oh, that's a troll! I thought that was Suarez, dude! Didn't that's even... That's so rude! The, the only reason Musler is in packs right now is for that troll. Suarez? No! Oh, that's a troll! I thought that was Suarez, dude! So that happened yesterday. So now I've been genuinely baited twice by a messy walkout and once by what I thought was finally a Suarez or good pull. Nicole 28T again. Yeah, man. Absolutely crazy. Um, absolutely crazy. Got gifted a sub yesterday without realizing. This morning I packed De Jong. Let's go, baby. GG's. Hey, hey, ooh, untradeable too. Okay. Um, diving. Okay, so that doesn't really matter. Get rid of all that. Crapola. That no scream. Okay, all of this stuff we're gonna save for Fonzie Davies tomorrow. Hopefully, dude. EA, don't don't disappoint, man. Please don't disappoint. How many mega packs do we have? Four megas. Okay. Not great, but you never know. So the two rare player packs. Normally, I would save them for tomorrow. Um, and really we've got like 71 dope packs for tomorrow, but because they kind of paid out pretty good yesterday, right? For yesterday's epi, let's pop these. We'll pop these. And then for this episode, because we don't have red player picks, we'll do these. Then we'll go do a few of, is that a walkout? Oh, it's going to be dead, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's not bad though. As we see fodder, boys. Oh. Mm. Mm. Nom, nom, nom. Something about cheese on toast with tomatoes. A little bit of za'atar for my Arabic viewers out there. And some onions. And a little bit of olive oil. Ya habibi. Oof. So good. Oh. No. 
Wait, another board? Cool. Alright. Yes, please. Nick, you're a strange dawn. Hey, man. When in Rome, dude. Put my La Liga rares into the wrong upgrade. I've seen a few people do that, man. Feels bad. The 81 plus pack? Yeah, we'll do the 81 plus pack to end off the EP2. Seeing a lot of people on Twitter getting some good stuff, so we'll do it. <laughs> what else, Liga players? Gonna have to sell my kidney for Paderborn players? I mean... They're already, dude, we pack, we were doing bronze pack method today. We packed a duplicate you fuck videos demonetized now. Cool. Uh, and he's like already 13 K. He was like seven K four days ago. Uh, so he'll be extinct for 20 K. Paderborn will be impossible to complete at least for the next week or so. Although I thought Norwich players and, and Sheffield players would come back down in price and, uh, they're still all extinct. So, and it's been what two weeks since the prem? It's not looking good, man. The main league SBCs, I think, are going to be hard to, to, to complete unless you're willing to spend, like, hundreds of thousands of coins on specific teams or you're willing to grind a dumb amount like we do on this account, like, to, to get bronzes and silvers and, and whatever, right? For me... Yeah, Bundesliga and Paderborn is ready. I miss the days of getting silver players from bronze packs. Dude. What are we talking? Is that FIFA 17 or FIFA 16? Dude, the bronze pack method was nuts even back then because of that. It might have even been FIFA 18, honestly. What was the first year we had SBCs, chap? Whatever that first year was, you could get silvers from bronze packs. It was nuts. It was so nuts. Yeah, okay, so FIFA 17. The poor man wrote to glory from FIFA 17. Most of the millions in the club were from the bronze pack method. And then, you know, whatever. Putting and grinding and SBCs and this, that, and the other. There are no red picks, guys. Unfortunately, no red picks. Oh, a double La Liga player set. That's great. It's very good. Now, to end today's epi, should we do... Um, should we do... 5 or 10... Uh, 25k packs. What do you guys think? And I'm not going to do another mid-icon. Not yet. We're going to craft a mid-icon slowly but surely. Which should we do 10 and just see where it goes? Unfortunately, we'll have to craft it during the episode, which I hope you guys are okay with. But, um... You have to do uh, 80 plus one? I have to do 80 plus one. What do you mean? Oh, I think I know what you mean. They won't show up for me 
because I have so many 81 pluses. Oh, yeah, we'll do the 81 plus pick, La Liga pack, you mean. Okay, never mind. I thought you guys were talking about something else. But that does bring up the thought that I don't think we'll even be able to open the 25k La Liga packs. The SBC pick. Yep, 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 yep. We'll do that. I don't want to do it on the web app, though. That's dead. Web app is so dead, dude. Having to spam packs on the web app the first week of the year is so trash. It's 82 rated. What, the 81 plus pick pack? That's hilarious. Seems to give out one team of the season. You... Wait. I'll go open mine and they'll all be 81 packs. 81, sorry, 81 rated players. Elsher always 10k. I got Ter Stegen from it. GG. Another duplicate Pareo. Yeah, we'll visit. Uh, oh, come on, blue. Oh, I was expecting blue flares. I got so excited, dude. Damn it. Anyways, um, at the end of this epi, just know as well, later on in stream, I'm going to be visiting uh, the Devil's Dungeon, if you will. Um, and we'll be popping through whatever those uh, crappy promo packs are. Hey, there we go. There are no discards, right, guys? So we can do one of them right here. Or craft one of them right here, right now, as we're going. Um, 81 plus pack. Should we just... Should we do this one right now? La Liga players 81 overall. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yo, should we do an, a separate episode? You know how today we were going to do viewer red player pick packs for La Liga. That's dead. So that video is not happening. Yesterday we did 20 or 30 times La Liga. Should we do like your guys' 81? I feel like most of my viewers will probably have already opened their 81 plus packs. But do you want me to do... That'd be, fun. That'd be a fun episode to do. Like 30 or 40 81 plus packs? Or are they terrible? Or we do 30 or 40 and or 50 or however many and we only show the good ones? I don't know. That could be a double upload for the day, I guess. I'll leave that one to Armalika if he wants to compile that, though, later after this episode is done. Um, I got four team of the seasons in the pick. Why are you always lying? Oh, my God. Uh, 82 rated, so I guess we don't use, right? Wait, which one am I doing, man? I'm so, I'm doing the wrong one, bro. I, I'm honestly doing the wrong one. Players from the same league, max three. Spanish players, one. 82 rated, 75 cam. Can I just clear this? Clear squad. Uh, okay. Okay. 75 chem 2 is just uh, obnoxious. But we did just pack him. I, I don't... I guess it doesn't really matter. Right? I was going to say I don't want to use La Liga players, but I'm not going to put the La Liga players into the 82 plus La Liga packs anymore. We're going to put them into the 25k packs. So all I need is rares. Use La Liga non-rares? Yeah, but we've cleaned the club out, so honestly, I don't think I'll have any. Pretty confident we won't have any. Dear God. This club is getting more crazy than ever. Um, 82 rated, so we could get Ever in there. Oh, and Jovic in there, actually. Boom, boom. It's not really ideal, but not bad. Okay. Um, gotta go to another league. Let's see what we got for player ratings in the Bundesliga. Goalkeeper. Right wing, Cam. Oh. Uh, 
Maybe we do this. Don't use Bundas. I'm okay. Uh, I'll use Bundas. I'm not too concerned about it, my dude. Like I said, for the Bundas grind and the full send, we are going to use... Um, we're going to use all just rares. So I'm not too concerned with using up some Bundas or, like I said, La Liga players. I, I don't really care. Sunday, I guess Sunday we can go unassigned on Bundes players, right? For whatever they drop on Monday or Tuesday for the Bundes upgrades. Bundes are going for over 2k. Yeah. Kind of unfortunate. But it is what it is. Seria. Just doesn't it's it's not that deep, dudes. We'll 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 be restocking all the players pretty damn fast. Wow, that see what I mean? This is all I got for Serie A right now. Okay. How about uh Big Un? Big yikes. That is a big yike. Like, what do I do with this card, by the way? He's untradeable and like trash. What do you even do with this? Honestly, is there anywhere I should I should probably use this in a team like this, realistically. Right? League SBC, sure, actually. Could could throw it into the League SBC. How many nationalities we got? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Okay. Players from the same league, max seven. I'm not gonna get I'm not gonna get the chem, am I? No way. Oh whoops. hell do i how do i hell how the hell do i make this work man got to just buy them right um got 383s the 78 is already going to hurt the rating so maybe we go like pickford if i grab a pickford or whatever the hell price he is Again, I guess now 83s and 82s are just insane money because of this pack. Yep. Um, That really pisses me off. Okay, hold on. Instead of Pickford. I'm mad. I'm really mad right now. So mad. Oh, nice. Okay. Um. Oh, he's Spanish too. I didn't really. Th oh my god, I didn't think that through. What's that? Eighty-two rated CB chat. What's that? Eighty-two rated CB. Uh, what's his name? Cotes, right? I'm mad. So mad. What a waste this is. What am I doing with my life, guys? Wait, I already have him? Okay. Didn't know that. Um. And Bundesliga RB. Perfect. Oh, no, it's not even needed. Okay. One more, one more, one more, one more. Now, Mathieu, for some dumb reason, is is expensive. Let's just see. What do I got in the club? What 
Ruben Diaz. I wonder if he works. Hey, hey! Dude, I'm sick at this! Look at me, guys. I'm so great. That's overkill, but who cares? All right. 81 plus pack. 99 Messi. Here we go, boys. I think you get to just open it right here, don't we? Come on, BB. Give me... Okay. Oh, for God's sakes. I forgot about this guy already. Uh... I mean, not bad. We got a bit of coke. Not the end of the world. La Liga Premium Player Pack. Here we go. This is the one. This is the one that Vegvorst gets thro thrown into. I got 96 all black. It's a win. That is a win, good sir. Tempted to even throw... No, no, no. Yeah, we could do... So wait, now we do everybody but Bundesliga, guys? Is that what we're doing now? I guess that's what we're doing. That's the play now. Okay. Everybody but Bundes. I've only packed Koke. Um, I guess we're gonna craft these, man. Why not? Well, let's try. Because red player picks are so dead, we got ourselves Walmart Hullet, right? Um, I'll do these later. But let, let's just pop the. Oh, fine. I thought I was waiting for Bundesliga Nick 28T. What are you doing? What are you doing, sir? Such a pleb, man. Clear all of this out. I don't know what these guys are doing, but we'll do a little bit. Of, we'll do a little bit of that. It, ooh, that guy didn't sell. Okay, that's not that's not terrible. Drop him down a bit. What were the picks? Uh pretty bad. Not gonna lie. Pretty, pretty. pretty. There's one guy I listed that I didn't want to list. Anyone remember? Who the hell it was? Oh, and you think these won't sell. They will all sell. I know they didn't go on bid, but honestly, a lazy buyer will be doing the SBC, and then we'll see this one be the cheapest, and we'll just buy it. So, gotta count on the lazy buyers, boys. Now, this one, okay, is not gonna sell, but there's the you fuck, dude. <sighs> Drop that down a bit. Bundesliga's next. Oh, that's a surprise. Oh, well. Yeah, if they don't sell for 250 by now, I do tend to discard. I don't think this one's going to sell either. Move on. Clear out the trade pile. All right. Get back to these packs. I'll open, I suppose, until we can get to the 25k packs. Does that make sense? So we'll pop the pop whatever packs we need to pop until we can get to the La Liga 25k packs. That's gonna be the uh that's gonna be the move. GTA 5 is free on Epic Games. Yep. PC only, which is cool too. So if you didn't get it for PC, now you've got the insane graphics and FPS and everything that you can get on PC with GTA. Ooh, GTA RP with the band of bros? How fun would that be? Honestly, Zway, all trolling and joking of Zway aside, he would be amazing in GTA RP. Like, he would honestly be... He could probably be as big as, um, like, what Summon is doing when he jumps on GTA RP, etc. That'd be, that'd be so great. I, I don't think I could be anywhere near as good at that, like, that type of a thing like Zway would. Zway would be fantastic. You know he'd be fully immersed in the character that he's building. I think I would be a Canadian Mountie if I were to do GTA RP. Do they have mooses or meese that you can ride? 
in uh in GTA as a mounty or is that not a thing? You and Zwei are my favorite streamers. Thank you, brother. Appreciate that, man. Hey, a lot of the lot, all the other Bandit Bros are awesome too, man. You gotta check them out. Remember when he crashed the plane in GTA? It's maybe one of my favorite moments uh, playing video games with friends. Most of my and again, don't tell Zwei this because obviously. We don't want his ego to get too big, but most of my most fun gaming memories on stream have been with like grinding with like playing games with Zwei and Nep. If not all of them, in fact. Take off Zwei. Oh my God, do we actually have the clip? Okay, I know, dude, I know, I know that we're opening packs right now. But please, for the love of God, allow me to just, for one minute, watch this back, okay? I'm sorry to do this to you guys if you've seen this before, but... Oh my God. Go Zwei, go Zwei, go Zwei, go Zwei, go Zwei, go! Go Zwei! Oh, look at this top, look at this top. Zwei! I am, I am, I am, I am! Zwei, the cops! I no. am going! Don't yell at me! We're gonna get out of here, boys! No! What is that? Get that shit out of here! Get that shit out of here! Oh, what? What? Oh, <laughs> Take off! Take off! Take off! Take off! The plane is so broken, I can't take off! Yeah! No! <laughs> for context there if you guys know this mission that moment took about six hours to get to there of failing certain other parts of the mission. that took us six hours to get to that moment that's the, one of the most annoying heists I've ever had to do, man. Um, so that's why it was even more emotional and stressful with that happening, man. Oh God, I hated that heist so much. The worst. And then, yeah, th then you have to like redo the whole thing. Oh God, oh God. We got it done like one, two, <laughs> one. Get that shit out of here! <laughs> oh, I fucking love Zway, man. He's such a sweetheart. One of the most iconic clips ever. Oh, one of these days, we gotta like put together, uh, and maybe even on stream, like uh, a feel good montage of like all the most ridiculous things that have happened on, on stream over the years. That'd be fun to look back at, for sure. Minus that one mishap. I could just spam clips. Hell yeah, dude. That'd be so fun, man. That'd be so fun. Well, yeah, I think most clips would be PUBG, honestly. That's a summer stream idea? Yeah, it could be fun. Could be fun. Top 10 would be Mubot spelling Eusebio. I think there'd be a lot of Wasted Wednesdays stuff in there, too, for sure. Please pray, play the frying pan. I, I, I don't have a clip of the frying pan or Zwei getting caught in the door. Like as a Twitch clip? I don't know if that there a Twitch clip exists. We made videos about it. Again, it's on YouTube. It's on my YouTube channel. But I, I don't think those are like clips. That might have been the frying pan, shooting Zwei in the back of the head. Um, that type of stuff I don't think was ever... It was before Twitch clips were even a thing. All right, I guess we're doing some 81 plus packs, dudes. Where the hell are these other packs? When Nep celebrated on Fortnite, thinking he got a sniper for his for sniper kill for his first win, and he got sniped. Yeah, that was amazing. That was great. You're resing him. 
uh, is pretty memed on the channel now. Zubia at CDM, and he scored, scored both goals as well. That's pretty memed. Wasted way. Is this it? Is that the actual one? No way, dude. How would you guys find these, dude? Okay, one more? One more. I know, I know, it's a... Look, it's a first owner RTG epi. We've already looked at a whatever dude team, which has nothing to do with the series. So I think and now we've looked at GTA funny moments. I think we can look at one more. If you've never seen this, I mean, maybe you don't watch my streams often, but... Um... That's great. That's good times. That is good times. Okay, that's it. That's it. That's it. We gotta get. We gotta get. We gotta get to grinding. We gotta get to grinding, dudes. Oh, all right. No discards, boys. There you go. Just by like you know popping packs here and there, we're 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 already well on our way to crafting. This is fantastic. When will there be a night full of those clips? I don't know. Like I said, I'm not uh, I'm not sure if that'll ever be a thing. That hyena laugh? What do you mean hyena laugh, dude? <laughs> That's hyena laugh? No, you don't mean that. Surely not. That's Bundesliga, right? Yeah. They call me MC fuck tits. Oh man. Streaming is so fun, dude really is you guys make it so <laughs> so good do i need 83 rated chat youtube sorry you can't answer during the episode so obviously i'm gonna ask the twitch chat do i need 83s main nation off league goals are going extinct dude all for the 81 plus packs it's hilarious For marquee matchups? Oh no, it's it is for marquee matchups. Okay, 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 okay. Roger that, dude. I might I, honestly, man. I'm, I might give marquee matchups a pass. Like I don't really care. I'd rather do upgrades instead. Okay, here we go. Any Bundesliga in there that we put in by accident because I'm an idiot? Other than the duplicate, of course. This. Let's do this, this, this. Ooh, not bad. I don't really know how that just worked. Uh, well, fortunately, I have to do that. Okay. Another one crafted. Actually, while we're crafting these, it would make sense to get rid of the La Liga players that I have, right? Because I'm just going to constantly get duplicates of them if we do these packs today. Oh yeah, that's a good point. I don't think about that. Marky matchups is a scam. Yeah, yeah. I agree. I agree. I just, you know what, man? They're they're good when you can do them with what you have in your club and you can um, piece them together this way and that. Damn it. This way and that from grinding, etc. Then it's all good. It's, you know, it's not, a, it's not that deep. But when you have to, like, go spend 7k on an off-league left back and whatever, nah. Yeah, it's absolutely not a scam if you use players from your club. 
But if, if you're going out there and spending the big money on them, that's a bit silly. And even then, I guess, yeah, it's not a scam. It's just terrible value. Awful value. I got Fakir from 81 plus. GG, man. You guys are doing way better than I am. Respect. Respect. Sri. Respect. Dude, that clip that I posted to Twitter uh, with the Ghanaian funeral dancers where Ronaldo was getting abused uh, by Atletico fans after the first leg with Juventus, where he went to, like, the, the reporters talking trash to him, saying, like, I have five, you have zero or whatever, and then annihilated Atletico in the, uh, in the, in the, the follow-up game. Oh, my God, with the Ghanaian uh, funeral meme, guys. That's probably one of the... I think that might be the best meme of that entire thing, I think. That was incredible. The coffin dance meme, yep. I think I think people are running that that meme into the ground though. It's already kind of old, isn't it? The Calvin troll with the coffin meme is even better. Oh yeah, I forgot someone did that. Yeah, that one was kind of mean as well, wasn't it? Can't do much with any of these guys, can I? What do we got for Devils? Oh my god. Alright, whatever, dude. No dents, boys. No dents. Uh... Thousand wins, yeah. We cracked that yesterday for the La Liga icon swap grind. Your CR7 pull in FIFA 18 was pretty cool. The one on the poor man road to glory, the striker, informed striker. That was from a two player pack too. Holy God. Was that striker Ronaldo from a two player pack as well? A two rare player upgrade pack. I, you know what? I can't remember. I couldn't confirm or deny that, but yeah, that was on uh, the poor man RTG. Oh no, it was a team of the week upgrade pack. Thank you. Oh, let's go. Come on, La Liga. Oh, okay, well, never mind. It's not a terrible card. Is he four star, four star at least? Is that four star, four star at least? Fada! Let's go! Ew, three star, th are you serious? He's three star, three star. No way, dude. Uh, 63 composure? 80 balance? On a five foot nine. Never mind. Whatever. That's S that is indeed SBC Fada. That is a terrible card, bro. Oh my god. So bad. Seventy four attack positioning. Like, what even is that card? Better than that eighty six Hullet. Hey, Walmart Hullet has feelings why are you guys so i haven't even used him in weekend league and you guys are already hating so hard on walmart hullet dude hey man can i stop packing the same goddamn player like every other pack has bauman in it dude annoying I'm putting my club into administration, bit bored. Hopefully it'll be worth it. It won't. It'll be fun while you're doing it. And then you'll open 23 million coins worth of packs like I did over the last month before team of the season and realize what the hell did I just do? I could have a moments Hullet, a moments Cruyff, a 99 Ronaldo and a few other players in my whatever dude team. But instead I put him into every single promo pack ever available during foot birthday and shapeshifters. God, am I happy I did that and got pretty much nothing in return.
What did we start at? We started at like 24 million, I think. I think that's where we were. Somewhere, somewhere around there, anyhow. Now you're talking about doing it again. I know, but at least it's for team of the season though, you know? A little bit better, ish. Team of the season counter? I'll pop, yeah, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll get it, I'll get it up there. I keep forgetting that we're Bundesliga is what we're holding now. Yep. Just the one Bundes batch. Uh, hold on a sec. If I did this, but then I also proceeded to do this, this, this. this. Yeah. Now the one crap. I think we're on three already. Just like that, dudes. Good stuff. It's not even a whatever dude account anymore. It should be an I'm addicted to packs account. No, that's the that's the ethos of my entire FIFA Ultimate Team experience is I'm addicted to packs. That was one of my best sellers uh, in my old clothing line back in like FIFA 13, 14, and 15. I was like a hottest seller. I was always like Steph and our designer came up with that. And I was like, eh, that's really cringe. Like addicted to like, who's going to walk around basically with a pack opening shirt on. And I always thought like these types of shirts are like, you know, the cool urban streetwear, like Nick 20 T with the splash X with fitted shirt, like long shirts, those sold. Okay. But it was those shirt, like the, the pack shirts that sold, man. I'm like, aha, why are people buying these? They're so cringe. But they did really well, very well. Whoever made the marquee matchup with the Australian league team needs to have their nuts cut off. Whoopsie doozy. Haller is 5K. So the real question is, with all of the packs that we're going to be spamming, do we sell off everything that has a value to put into us, us going unassigned on Sunday and then us going unassigned on, um, I don't want to open these because there could be an Alfonso Davies in here, man. I mean, I guess there could be an Alfonso Davies in one of these tomorrow too, but. Why are 81 plus packs worse than gold two player upgrade packs for me? Have we even gotten one board? I think we got one. We got that Taliso or whatever, right? Maybe Lamar too. Bro, I open gold two player upgrade packs and every other pack is a walkout. Or at least a board. Use Portuguese players for marking matchups. Uh... Australian League? Okay. Will, thank you again, guys. To everybody that's subbing with the paused alerts, they'll, they'll come back uh, once we're done this epi. I'm kind of like just getting stuck in on this grind, so. Ew, dude. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Now we can get the La Liga packs. Am I missing anything else for today, dudes? Really sucks that these red player picks uh, haven't worked, but... You know, whatevs. Um, Jerico, thank you for the 34 as well, man. Appreciate you. All right. 
I think we're good. We did everything, right? Are you going to do people's 81 pluses? Yeah, I think we will. We got to visit uh, the devil's points section. Um, we got to get this episode up. All of that stuff, right? We're going to go to the, uh, yeah, whatever. Whatever we, what, what, what was the name? Devil's Dungeon? Whatever. I don't, I don't know. All right. And then I think for the rest of the stream, we'll craft these 25k packs and just have some fun with them. See if we can uh, can get anything. Satan's Laboratory. Lucifer's Lunchbox. I kind of like that. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. What the hell are the other packs, though? Are they 82 plus packs? There's a board. Number two. Damn it. Should I put my rares into 81 plus packs? No, La Liga packs. La Liga packs for sure. Yes, we can keep going. I think we can do one more. Might be able to do a few more as well. Hold your horses. Oh, that's what they are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the few packs that we have that we've been saving. Okay, all good. La Liga premium player packs. Not even a board, boys. I wonder. Has uh, any content creator been spamming these on their account? Are they as good as what I was getting last week for the Prem? Okay. Well, we get to do a few more. M maybe one or two more. Potentially. So we're going to do... We're going to get rid of that. La Liga Premium Upgrade. Gold Upgrade. So that, that's the system, okay? For those of you guys that are wondering what I'm going to do on stream today... We're gonna we're gonna rinse through both of these basically. So first things first, this is kind of cool. I, I like that at least YouTube can see the grind that we'll do on stream. They get an idea of uh, of how we're gonna go about doing it on stream. So you know we we clear all of this stuff out, get it all gone. Goodbye, goodbye. Go. Did two got Ramos? Must be nice. Wait, really? Huh? Oh, there we go. Okay. Recycle La Liga rares into 82 plus. No. I, so last week I recycled the Prem rares into the four Prem player packs. I actually think for like logistics, I would just keep to these two. I We did get one team of the season from like 40 or something four rare prem player packs but they all really did come out of these so i would say um i would say stick to those two and have like a just have a rule where you do not discard any duplicates you know okay it's a little bit dry it's a little bit boring because you're constantly every two or three packs you're going back into the sbc section and crafting more packs but hey man it's worth it it is worth it 82 plus players are insanely OP. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if I even agree. They weren't OP for me, put it that way. I think we hit a Santi from one, right? Did I do the player pick? Yeah, we got a Koke. Unfortunately. But again, dude, you, you get sick pack pulls from the most weird ass places, so. There's no rules, man, with the way this game is coded. Just whether or not you have good uh, or bad pack luck, really. Close. Perfect. What instructions do I have on my box to box? Uh, get forward, cover center, and uh, cut passing lanes. Like when you're when you're defending, kind of like wakes them up a little bit. Go. 
Gato Campos, yikes. Biggest of yikes. You know what was really fun what we did last year to finish off the year on the first stoner uh, poor man RTG? Remember when we spent the final two or three weeks and we rinsed every last little thing in the club? Every single crappy rare, every single crappy non-rare, but every single like low rated in form, we put them into various areas and we just finished off with like the craziest club with the craziest players remaining per league and like per nation. That was fun, man. I miss how like grindable FIFA 19 menus were because of the icon SBCs. You know, like every icon SBC you could get rid of 11 rare bronzes and 11 rare silvers. You could get rid of all of your low rated informs. Oh, it was it was it was much better than what we have right now. Which is crazy that a, a newer iteration of the game is actually less efficient and less rewarding than an older iteration. But more profitable for EA, right? And that's uh, that's their focus. For sure, it's been a, a more profitable this year than last year. Everybody will say, oh, FIFA 20 was the deadest, worst game ever, and EA will be posting record profits. So, who's winning? Not us. I get one more. Come on. We sneak one more upgrade. I want to use any rares. Do you guys remember who the uh who the player is I even need to get rid of? That that's cleaned out the club. Golds are really expensive right now. Yeah. Okay, I just use like the whatever I have sitting and chilling in my club, man. Not, not too concerned with it. Oh, shit, not Bundesliga, right? Oops. Oops. Marilo was the dupe? Okay. Either way, I'm going to try and get rid of all the... Uh... All the La Liga players as we uh, as we go through this. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, if I needed the chem, oh wow, no, never mind. I don't even get any more chem there. Okay, there we go. Five K pack method viable, very viable right now. Yes, absolutely. Ab so frickin lootly, dude. One hundred percent. I think I'm gonna show you guys how we grind down to nothing left in the club. I mean, for this episode. Hopefully, uh, it's not too boring. But I, I'm enjoying myself, so I think that's all that matters, really, right? Be a selfish content creator and just do what makes you happy. <laughs> there we go. There's Marilo. Servers are broken. Don't tell me that, dude. About to about to get some practice games in with my uh with a whatever dude set up. Yes, sir. Red picks aren't fixed yet. Nope, unfortunately. I'm kind of trying to extend this episode too to see if like EA just push out a fix while we're uh, still recording. Otherwise, it's probably like it's going to be a weird episode tomorrow. The Bundesliga drop, huge pack spam, a review of like my night of opening packs and red player picks. Like, it's going to be going to be kind of shit. Maybe we do like two episodes tomorrow as well. I don't fucking know. I got to play ten games a weekend league tomorrow. It's going to be a bit of a clusterfuck of a day gonna be a bit trash actually the aussie league marquee matchups is mad yeah i don't think i'm gonna do it i think you guys have uh convinced me to stay the hell away last time this happened it took them four days to fix it so there you go 
won't even be uh, until next week, right? Keep forgetting, man. I keep forgetting that I'm I'm holding Bundesliga. I need to hold Bundesliga. It's been a full week of me like having to focus on La Liga players. It is starting to trip me out. And if I do this, that should work. Das. Any Bundes in there by accident? Nope. What buttons do I press to get the goalkeeper in career mode? I remember it being the middle thing. You click this thing. And then you gotta like hold L2 all game long, which is really annoying, but that way it just keeps your keeper centered and you get to watch the team do whatever the hell they do. I think it was. I don't know if they've changed it from the touchpad or I don't know if they've gotten rid of that as even being an option, but that's what it used to be. all these La Liga players in first by all of them I mean all six okay we'll do uno mas and then we'll get these open think we can get the chem Yikes, this is actually getting a little bit. Oh yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. God knows how many Sesk uh, Fabregas cards I have. So I think I'm going to throw him in there too. That. Do that. That. And... And... Ah. There we go. More packs, buddies! Got Santi from a player pick. GG. Santi looks to be a great card. Obviously, when you want the sexy players, he's not the top of anybody's list, but. Wait, did I have a Bundes player at right back? Oh. I'm annoyed with myself. EA did not fix rewards. No. I, I Yeah. As many people are pointing out, It'll, it could be days. Finally. Finally what, Christy? Much love, Nate. I appreciate you, brother. Subs will come up soon, dude. Sorry. Kind of got like a two-hour pause on, on sub alerts. It was on Saturday that they fixed it last year? Are you sure? I thought it was on Monday or Tuesday. Got Fakir from an 81 plus. GG. Yeah, we hit one, two team of the, two team of the seasons technically today. We did get Hullet today, albeit everybody's mad because it's the Walmart Hullet. Um, we didn't get our red player picks, which is... Yeah, 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 okay. Did we craft two or three? So this is going to take us to like six or seven, depending. Six or seven of these. Nah. Nah. Ah. Uh, please don't be a duplicate. Oh, it's, well, it's going to be trash. <laughs> not only is it not a duplicate, it's Arsenal fans going wild for Lucas Perez. Get out of here, dudes. Fodder, boys. <laughs> we got another little bit of SBC fodder. That's okay. That's all right. I'll take that. 
That's technically three team of the season packed this episode. As unfortunate as the red picks not being a thing, we did all right. Mid icon, don't worry. We'll be doing mid. We'll be, we'll be doing mid icons. Um, can confirm. We will be. Wait, what already? Okay. No discards, dudes. It's a rule. Don't get mad at me for it. It's a bloody rule. Uh, okay. Ooh, this guy, right? Uno mas? No, Boku masses. All of the masses. Um. Wait, what happened? Nice. I'm gonna see if we can do one more too. Now we're gonna we're gonna try Root Hullet today. We're gonna get some games until like, you know, the boys are ready to play Warzone. We'll continue grinding on this account. I don't know. I mean, the guys might not even play Warzone today, right? Uh, considering. Yeah, I guess that wouldn't really work, would it? Yeah, he's just saving up everybody's red messies. Respect. Okay, that's it. Yeah, the thousand wins is going to get ruined, you could almost say, this weekend. Or today. Just woke up and what was the 6pm content? Uh, EA screwing up red player picks. Winning to get Reguillon, got booted off. Yikes. Two La Liga players are always cool. Been rinsing to the 25Ks nonstop. They're fun to do, man. I, I, I really... Can someone keep track? Three. This So this should take us to eight 25K packs crafted, just this epi. Right? I think. Can we go back to back, team of the seasons? No. Not even a board. Update counter. Yeah, I'll have to update it to 59. CBA to do it right now. Bro, how the hell am I getting duplicates? Oh my god. This is gonna take forever. That's mad, dude. Watch me not use the right guy. Oh my god, you know what? I don't remember who it is. Who the heck is it? It's, uh... Uh, it's not... I don't think it's any of these guys. It's... I'll recognize... There he is, this guy. Vukasevich, I think it was. CDM. Yeah, yeah. I remember he had, like, the... the almost the vampire-y looking badge or whatever. As a DM. And we're back on it! Getting a little bit unlucky with all these, like, dupes. Banned from SBCs already. Try web app. I think web app is the place to do it, man. You might be just doing the SBCs too quickly. Like, it, it's too efficient for EA, so they ban you for it. Unfortunately, sometimes SBC bans can last 12 hours. But hey, guess what? The FIFA point section will be clear and open, no matter how much you spend there. So... What's an SBC ban? If you too efficiently or too quickly complete SBCs, uh, EA bans you so that you can't efficiently grind SBCs to make the most of your club and your coins and what the time and effort you put into the game. They do that, so again, you're more likely to get frustrated. Oh, for f uh, you're more likely to get frustrated and go over to um, the FIFA points section. That's been a thing for ages, guys. We've talked about it a lot. A lot.
Yeah, that's not n new news. It's just because you're not doing them quickly or efficiently, uh, like, or not quickly or efficiently enough. Like, if you do the uh, SBC building system that I do, if you rinse through ten, the, the 10 teams of 11 identical players too fast, you get, I, I get SBC banned for, like, an hour. You have to almost, you have to almost be not efficient to do it. I actually don't know. Oh, yeah, it was good, good, good lie or whatever, right? Thought flipping animals was, was a fun game. Yeah, gets really old having to flip dinosaurs every, like, 10 SBCs crafted. I put club into administration or no? That's up to you, my man. I would pick your favorite league or your favorite player from the league and then go into administration for that specific player, maybe. Uh, it's at, we're 59. We're at 59 right now. Sorry, guys. Don't know what's happening. There we go. All right. The ultimate efficiency, dudes. I just want blues, then I'll grind back up. Yeah, why not? Blues and mid-icons is, uh, is a good time. How many times do you guys think I'm going to forget all of the uh, the Bundesliga players? How many times? All of the times? Okay, I think we have what's his name what's his name in there, right? Oh. Oh. Gold Hazard or SBC Fat uh oh Ansu Fati man fun card just a cool card too I, I, I wanted to kind of just run some games with him for the like the Spanish objectives but kind of give up on that pretty quick okay let's just do this and then maybe we'll even do all of this and leave like one uh or two players incomplete like so and then that that way whenever we get the duplicate la liga we just throw them in there and then you know it's a little bit quicker nine hours later and ea haven't commented on uh the reds yep Rami sells for 6k. Doesn't matter. All these players are untradeable. This is still the epi. Yep. We're going to keep going until closer to the two hour mark. Or until I run out of players. Or run out of packs. Whichever comes first, I suppose. I wasn't really planning on doing this for this epi, but this is kind of fun. Like every, every two or three minutes we get to open a few more packs. And then craft a little for two or three minutes, then open more packs. No, no news on the Pro League either. Yeah, honestly, it might just never come back at this point. I, I hope someone's keeping track of these La Liga packs we've crafted. I'm not. That's a board! Come on, blue! No, dude, damn it. Oh, 83 rated. Yes! I might play for Elite this week. We'll see. Or try to get uh, play for Elite. Play till we bottle elite more like it knowing me okay this might be the final pack of the epi boys uh we got ourselves a good a good haul of blues i'm gonna keep doing this exact grind you watched on youtube oh that's not even finishing with a board dear god that's tough um i'm gonna keep doing this grind on stream uh i'll be going today probably until at least 3 or 4 a.m. UK time. So these epis usually go up anywhere from 10 to midnight. So when you watch or get to the end of this episode, I'll still be streaming um, and spamming packs. And then 
you know, if you don't want to watch the streams, whatever good players we get from this pack spam at the start of tomorrow's epi, we'll go over it and show you guys the type of players that we're adding into the team or we got added into the team or maybe we got players from the devil devil's laboratory that will help us towards Project Hullet. So God bless you guys. Thank you so much for watching and supporting the channel. And I cannot wait to grind more on stream, but more importantly, I can't wait for a hopefully left back 91 rated left wing back Canadian dream tomorrow and sending the club into administration to try and pack them. Catch on the flip side. Peace.